Need more help or just want to show your support? Then head over to my Patreon and join my team, where you can get exclusive content like ebooks and bonus plays, as well as early access to my bits and more. Link in the description below. All right, welcome back, YouTubers and Madden fans. This is Madden Money Shot. I got some more gameplay footage for you. This is some really early uh, Madden 18 stuff I got right here uh, from my EA Access trial. Uh, basically, you know, I had some really good gameplay footage, some nasty, nasty running plays um, that I got on tape. And I wanted to show you guys There's some really good stuff here. Uh, I really think, I don't know if it's me, I don't know if running's really easy in this game, but you're going to see here in a minute. Uh, first play here, I mean, the people aren't really getting the weak box system. I switched it up to an inside run, and you see Melvin Gordon just put on some of the nastiest moves. Look at that as he just jukes them out of his shoes. I get a little bit too crazy because I didn't think that he was going to miss that second guy. So that, was to me, was just an insane run. You're going to see some insane runs by Melvin Gordon in this game today. Although the second play, you see how it didn't work out so good. So this guy wasn't a complete bum. It's just that I, I just put on some nastiness right there. So here, he's actually playing some pretty good defense after that first really bad mistake. Um, he's just coming out, you know, in some, in some really bad formations. So he's got me to a fourth and a 16. I'm going for it, which I typically don't do. But after that first run, I feel like I have to. I mean, it's, you know, get a nice play. All these plays you're looking at right, by the way, are already on my on my uh, YouTube channel. So I'll try to pop some links so you guys can see the actual, um, you know, the actual vids. Uh, but this whole series of plays is out of the Eagles playbook. Um, and you can see how money it is. You can see how well they're working. Uh, so here I'm actually, like, I'm going to take advantage of that weak box system again. He keeps coming out in something that looks like a dollar or a dime. You can't do that this year. I make him pay for it. Going up 7 nothing. This LA team, by the way, is one of the top teams on my list for franchise mode. I really think I might end up with them. They just seem so loaded with talent. So here, second and 10, I'm not paying attention to the weak box this time. That He beats me with it. Um, you know, for the most part, I come out, uh, you know, respecting the run pretty much every time. There, I send a nice little blitz. It's a screen, though. How often can you get to the quarterback before a screen gets off? Uh, it's all good. So here, it looks like I jumped that last second, but the computer didn't say I used alerted. So it's all good. I get that pick. It's going to get some nice, easy uh, yards here. Uh, Gordon, like I said, this dude, you're going to see some nasty runs. Look at that, man. That juke is just crazy. This guy right here is one of the reasons I want to take the charges, man. He is just a beast. This whole team is just feeling beastly. Everything except for probably Phillip Rivers. So he gets the ball back. Hits it to what? I think it's his fullback or something like that. I mean, this guy right here, he's already in a situation where he's got to make something happen. I just was not there. I was just underneath that to the point where I couldn't make a play. It's all good, though. Third and two. Um, sending that blitz again. That's that safety blitz. Trey Boston, the safety. I didn't even know was on that team. But I feel like if I take this team in franchise mode, I can make something happen. So fourth and eight, he goes for it. I hate how they make you flip around. Like, I'd make a play out of it anyway, going for that pick six, even though it should have been a much cleaner one. And this dude just couldn't handle it, man. He just pulls the plug. He does not want to see that play happen. So he just puts out on me. I understand, but it's just funny how he, just, he must have had to rip that out the wall. So next play, this was one of my first uh, ranked draft or mutt draft games. And I'm really trying some new defenses. This is like a 3 through 5 and it just is terrible. Like, <laughs> like I was live lab in plays, and this thing was just complete junk. As you can see, my, my, my team just gets pancaked. My defensive tackle gets pancaked. He holds nothing down. First play, I give up a huge touchdown. It's all go good, though. You're going to see how I get some plays, uh, you know, my way. Uh, first pass play right to the tight end. Nice little thread of needle there. Um, this pass play right here, I mean, you're going to see Devontae Freeman go off in this game. I kind of get, you know, a little bit caught in my blocks, but there was just so much space there if I could have made that happen. So we're going to run that again. And look at that, man. There's just, like, this game is like running in an open field half the time. I don't know why. The D it's so easy to run this game. And if you can make a move here and there, you're almost unstoppable. You're going to see these running backs. You're going to see my running backs, man. This is early on in the game. You're going to see how easily I was dominating. Like, I'm playing on damn arcade mode. So, it's tied up game. You know what I'm saying? It didn't take me long to score. It didn't take him long to score. Uh, this is not going to be a defensive struggle. I'll tell you that right now. My defense is definitely picking up, though. Like I said, early on, I was labbing a lot of stuff. And this is what I found. This right here, this is one of my favorite defenses. He goes away from the blitz, though. I think it's a pretty good game. Um, here, you know, I'm not even sure what defense I'm running, but he's going to get that first down. Third inches. You know what I'm saying? No big deal. It's going to happen. Uh, running that uh, that bench switch, that bench switch, I, I don't know why, man. That never works for me. I was never a fan of the bench switch. Uh, here, I'm pressing on cover three. I found out right away, in this year, this Madden, you cannot press on cover three. I don't know what it is, but every time I press on cover three, I get burned like that. So I, I learned that to stop doing that pretty quickly. Um, here, we're doing some nice passing plays. Like I said, man, this offense is OP. It's like you're just running in a field open by yourself. It's like there's just no defense in this game. I have a really good offense, too, by the way. Really good players. Um, here we're going to go with um, 
you know, really good play, uh, uh, running that hurry up. We're just this is just a really good book, the Eagles Playbook. It's probably gonna be one of my first ebooks I make here in a little while. I don't know if I'm biased just because it's my birds. Um, here, Warren Moon quarterbacks are OP too this year, man. It's like it's like they, they used to be, be fumbling like every five seconds, but they don't do that no more. So this run play right here, this is a, just your typical power O, PA power O, and I just get a nasty. Uh, juke into a stiff arm. I mean, just, just the run moves. If you have a top-notch running back, you can just put on a show out there. So here we go. I'm going back to my classic 335. Still works. My 35 wide nine. Get some pressure and all that. You know what I'm saying? I sent that corner last second. Well, actually, it might have been the safety, but I right-clicked that to send him last second, and I took over his zone. Screens, though, man, this has been my kryptonite this year. People that spam, uh, that spam screens. I just, I don't know why, but I just, I have a hard time sniffing them out. I used to have such a good feel for it. I feel like they're sneakier this year. Uh, once you see these OP running backs, man, like, you know, what I'm saying, they, they just half a, have half a running back for whatever reason, is just godly in this game. So here we go. I'm sending that same blitz that I've been running pretty much this entire game. A really good blitz. Um, here he's running that. Uh, is that a mesh? It looks like he's doing his own little thing with the mesh pattern there. Chucks it up out of bounds. You know what I'm saying it is, it is what it is. I'm just, you know, deep coverage is looking pretty good. My safeties are handling the ball pretty good deep. And then here he's going to chuck it up for the end zone. And I think that was another huge pick, but they didn't give me credit for it. It's all good. You don't throw deep on me, man. That's something that I don't care what game it is 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. You don't throw deep on me. You're going to you're gonna regret it. And what do you know on the very next play? I'm going, I'm going big time right again, man. Devontae Freeman, he's got all the tools I need. And I don't know if it's him, I don't know if it's me. I mean, look at that juke. Dude behind me misses. I mean, this is just dirty. That should be a back-breaking play, going from the almost scoring to getting picked to getting busted on a huge touchdown. Uh, a lot of opponents really would start, you know, hurting after that. So this guy, though, he's got a lot of time. I mean, he, he's, he's, you know, two minutes plus uh, trying to run the ball right away. He's not, he's not panicking like a lot of people do, third and seven. Um, you know, he just keeps running. And once again, he, he, he hits me on the weak box system, man. I mean, that's just ridiculous. Look at these arcade stats. Six carries, 117 yards. You know my running back's got like 200 yards. I mean, I don't know what's wrong with this game. Early on, the running game was just ridiculous. I don't know if it's if it's toned down a little bit now because people have figured out defense. But uh, but the defense was just OP. And, or the offense was just OP and crazy early on in this game. As you can see, a result of, of that with the stats. I mean, it's just like I said. It's like nobody's out there. So this play right here. You know what I'm saying? He tries, I think he runs the same play twice in a row. There he tries the dot sideline. Uh, doesn't really work out here. Screenplay, man. That's been my kryptonite, like I said. Uh, doesn't get, the, you know, only gets about five. But it's just typically, I used to sniff that out for losses or, or just shut it down. I'm just not doing it this year. So here, getting some pressure. You know what I'm saying? My man just, he just gets away. He makes a shake, makes bake. Uh, tries to throw it away last minute, gets sacked. Luckily, uh, Ziggy Hood, man, I don't even know where he came from. So I get the ball. He punts it away. I get the ball. Gets me down around the six. Uh, I get out of danger, but I don't do nothing with it. So second half, I get ball again. Up seven. You know I'm saying? I don't have to do much. If only would have got that block, I probably would have been going again. But you know what I'm saying? I can't complain. Eight carries, 116 yards. Does that, think, does that say three touchdowns? I mean, it's just it's crazy how OP running is in this game. So here, you know what I'm saying? He meets me right in the hole. All I got to do is, you know, I don't even think I hit the button right. He just spun out of that. You know what I'm saying? I got four yards. Like, it's just so easy mode. So we're going to, you know, go to third inches. And, of course, I'm going to run the ball. I mean, why would I do anything else? It got to the point early on in this game, I, I really kind of felt guilty running the ball so easily to the point where I think it, it kind of messed with me. And I started doing stuff where I didn't need to, like passing the ball here. I could have easily just kept running the ball. But I decided to throw it for some reason. I don't know. Maybe because I thought I got to learn to throw the ball better in this edition of Madden to the point where I felt the need to do that. Maybe that's what it was. But you see how it messes me over. So it is what it is. That is a real big turning point in this game. He gets the ball down only seven. My defense still standing up. You're seeing that big hit stick. You know what I'm saying? You never see David Johnson flying around like that in real life. Uh, but here we go. You know, he's still pounding the ball. He's playing smart. Like I said, I don't know if I, if I took this living against live opponents thing a little too serious, um, but he's he's playing a little bit smarter than I am right now. There, I don't know what I meant. It, my, my dude just didn't break on the ball. I switched to the, to the defender. He just kind of like froze up there a little bit. Kind of dumb. Is what it is. These outside zones really don't cover like they should too. As my man, you know, busts me up, gets all the way down to uh, first and goal. And you know it ain't going to be long before he punches in. He's trying to run his quarterback. This guy's been a real... You know, run with the quarterback type of player. He's got Cam Newton, which you know, if I did, I probably would too. Uh, but this, this is my 3-3-5 standing up here in the middle a little bit. 4-4 uh, now. 
uh, trying to get it done. I probably should have stayed at 35 as he hits me right where my zone would have been. Somebody would have scored there, man, but two guys were open, so it really doesn't matter. So 21 all, not hitting my holes. I'm saying right there, I could have been going again. I mean, you know, I can't be mad considering how well I run to this point. But now when I really need my running game to step up, it ain't working. So here I go with the bench switch. Like I said, you guys probably never seen me run a bench switch. It's not my play. Not anymore. Maybe a couple of Maddens ago. Uh, I tried to squeeze it in the window. Not playing smart. And look at that, man. The first tip pick of the season. I can't say I noticed a lot of tip picks like I did last year. Last year, tip picks was insane. Uh, this year, it's not so bad. But uh, it, it, that's actually the only time this whole season where a tip pick has gotten me, if you really want to tweet about it. So here we go. Uh, this guy's just dinking and dunking me. I was sending like an all-out blitz there. It's another thing I don't do. Really uncharacteristic of me. Uh, it is what it is. Like I said, these were some of the first games I played. I hadn't played Madden in quite a bit because I kind of gave it a rest, um, getting getting ready for the new season. And now I'm down seven. I still got a chance. A uh, minute 42 left. Running to hurry up. Accidentally switching the, <laughs> accidentally talking with the cam camera. That's how out of sync I am. Uh, I'm picking, I mean, this offensive playbook, I don't really even know. These are all plays I wouldn't typically run. I was scratching my head. I should have spent more time labbing, but when you got EA Access, you only got an hour. You know what I'm saying? I had to make as many, many games, as many videos as I could with that 10 hours, so I didn't get a lot of lab time. Uh, it is what it is, though. You can see I'm, I'm constantly running this power play as, you know, my blocker just doesn't get out there in front of me like I need him to. Uh, less than a minute to go. You know what I'm saying? We're going to chuck it up. Really bad decision once again. Uh, you know, just, just uncharacteristic football by me, and, and that's it. I don't, I don't wait around. 50 seconds left. That's game. I hate to be the quitter, but it is what it is. I had to move on because, like I said, you only got 10 hours. So what am I sticking around for? So that's it. You win some, you lose some. It's all good. I'm actually. This was the last game I actually lost, which is a while back. So it's all good. Uh, if you guys want to see more video of uh, gameplay, hit the like button. I'll do that. Other than that, thanks for watching, man. Money shit out.